Fall is in the air, and it's time for the annual War on Christmas to begin. It appears the first shot of this year was fired by the American Humanist Association with their lawsuits to interfere with poor children getting Christmas presents from Samaritan's Purse. This is a low blow, even for the God-hating left. I've helped Samaritan's Purse with this project. My nephew, Robert, and I loaded thousands of Christmas gifts onto trucks one year to send to the poorest kids in the world. And I've met some of those kids when I served in Africa and Haiti. I was once part of a team bringing food to families who lived in a garbage dump. They spent their days poking through the garbage trying to find enough food for their families. My job was to feed the kids who lined up to get a slice of bologna and a slice of cheese. And I will never forget the day we ran out of food and I had to look at all those hungry kids and tell them there was nothing left for them. And I remember hungry little girls trying to make themselves pretty by finding colored string to tie around their necks, pretending it was jewelry. Do you have any idea how much it means to them to get a beautifully wrapped Christmas gift? Some that have real necklaces for them, along with dolls, toothpaste, chewing gum, and yes, a little booklet in their language that tells about the love of God and how they can have eternal life. That little booklet is why these evil people are filing their lawsuits. The enemies of faith are willing to take Christmas away from the poorest kids in the world to keep them from hearing the message of hope and eternal life. What is wrong with you people? Are you really willing to hurt those kids to satisfy your bigotry? You members of the American Humanist Association are the worst of humanity and a disgrace to what the USA stands for. Oh yes, the war on Christmas is very real. This is Wild Bill for America. Thank you for watching, and America, bless God again.